there's gonna be some changes made. Give me something. You got to stand up. I know my sister somewhere in the world. Okay, let's begin. Uh, this is going to be my review of The Color Purple. A picture of me doing this. Okay. The Color Purple. Alright, so The Color Purple is a new movie which is a uh, star in... Uh, some people that I know, but I can't really think of it. Uh, it is a remake of the of the 1980s film. I guess it's a classic film. Is 80s really classic at this point? I guess it is, but I mean, I guess it was before my lifetime, so I guess it's classic. But um, this is a it's a remake of the classic Steven Spielberg movie. Um, and I remember, I've seen the movie once a long time ago. I believe I watched it with Mom back in the day. And I remember liking the movie, sorry, but I don't remember really anything about it. So it was very interesting to check out the new remake of The Color Purple. And hey, it's a musical because why not? Um, I have to say, this was the movie that I was like, I don't know if it's good. I don't know if it's bad. And I have to say... I enjoyed the heck out of this movie, and I really thought the musical element of this movie made the movie kind of enjoyable. Like it's like you're you're basically it's forty years of this woman's life as she is basically being used by and, and it's 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 one thing that was close kind of cool was the world building like of this uh, little town in Alabama or is is it Alabama yeah it's Alabama or Tennessee. Uh, wherever it is, but it's, you see it's like, because it begins in like 1901, and it goes all the way up to 1947, so it's just to see the elevation of the of the technology in the town was kind of, uh, that was kind of cool that the filmmakers were able to show a progression of this world that we're in. Uh, there, uh, the musical numbers, not the musical numbers were, I can't think of any musical number that really caught my ear, kind of like what Wonka did, but I think the story is really what, and the driving force is really what makes this movie really uh, well done. Overall, I think The Color Purple is one of the best movies of 2023 so far I've seen. This will probably, this will be my last movie review of the year. And I have other reviews coming, but they won't be out until 2024. Those will still count as my 20, on my 2023 top 10 movie list. But The Color Purple will be the only movie that, in my mind... I want people to see before I do my top 10 because it is a movie that I will probably talk about in my top 10 movies in 2023 with Randy Cage in a few days. So guys, I am going to give The Color Purple an A. So guys, have you seen The Color Purple? What are your thoughts? Comment below. Let me know. And guys, if you like this video, go thumbs up, subscribe, support, and tell your friends about Easy Nation. All too easy.